Hey everybody, how you doing? It's uh, Brent back for Dab Rat Laboratories. Today I have a uh, source product I wanted to give you guys a look at. It's new. It's the uh, new quad coil with black ceramic and grade 1 titanium. Uh, I like it a lot so far. It's probably my favorite coil that they've produced to this point. Cheers, guys. <laughs> Delicious. Woo. That was some uh, Scooby treats. <coughs> Live resin. All right. So uh, give you guys a look at one of these things. <coughs> uh, I have a new one here, so you can get a good look at what a fresh one looks like out of the box. And they come in these little boxes, each one. <coughs> and then this is the biggest coil I've probably seen. The fatty. And the inside looks like. Got four in there, real tight wraps. Uh, just a real high quality coil. Um, I, <coughs> the materials used apparently are pretty high quality as well. They're big about safety and all that. So Let me show you guys how this works. Um, I set it at 25 watts, 420 Fahrenheit, and uh, sitting at 0.36 ohms on my source volt 60 watt. Not sure if you guys can get a very good look at that. <clears throat> I'll go ahead load up some I got some orange soda crumble I'll put in there see how that does and uh, you can load a very large amount in here um, I tend to not load that much I mean I load a way fatter dab than I would regularly but I still I'm not loading like a half gram in here because um, you're still going to burn off all your flavor before you're done with your oil. Don't any other atomizer. But you can definitely load some mega dabs on this thing. And it works out really, really well. Alright. And uh, I'm using a slick for a card cap on this thing. And it's working pretty well for me. Uh, I've just tried a few different things and nothing seems to work quite as well. I just can't get anything to, to, uh, I like to make a full seal. I don't like having that little hole that a regular card cap has. Because I find that I have to turn my heat up a little bit hotter than I would like to. So, uh, here's what I loaded in here. I dumped it on the top. Some of it rolled off a little bit. Alright, cheers guys. Source Quad Coil. Damn. <coughs> that was just a humongous hit. It wasn't like hot. <coughs> Super flavorful. A good lord. <laughs> you can get some rippers off these things. Uh, I've been using this one for about a month now. I think I cleaned it twice, giving it two isopropylene baths. And uh, <coughs> it's still going hard for me. Um, they told me they have the, uh, the XXL... Uh, coilless titanium bucket coming in the mail so that should be here in the next couple days <coughs> and i'll show you that guys that one too you guys so let me hit this one more time for you guys Shoot. <coughs> so i pretty much took down that whole hit that's another thing about these that i i'm liking and there's not a lot of waste uh, I'm not finding a lot of oil at the uh, bottom of my chamber there, uh, wasting it, you know, it's not cooling up really, it's pretty much taking everything I give it, I'm not getting uh, much waste out of this, a bit less than most other coils, so it's working pretty well, I'm very impressed with this coil, I like it, I've been using it a lot, <coughs> uh, source baits, quad coil with the grade 1 titanium, uh, I dig it a lot. And actually, real quick, I'll show you uh, how it hits on the XL 
Orb, the Orb XL. Mm, this is my favorite bubbler that they make, the drop down. I just prefer this type of bubbler in general for these portable vapes. Pull this off right here. And uh, these XL coils fit the, the uh, regular source nail. They're calling it the Nail XL now, but it's still the original, you know, the same nail base. It just fits these coils. I think they did it to make it a little bit less confusing. But one thing they did to these is put, made it so it's uh, leak. There's like a reservoir in here now, so if your coil leaks, you know, because they will, you know, clean it out soon enough, a little bit faster than some other ones I've seen. And instead of getting onto your battery, it'll just pool up inside of there. So that's pretty cool that they did that. All right. Throw this XL onto my source bolt 60 watt. Cap. Pretty much the same settings. I do like to turn my heat up um, with uh, the orb because I'm not controlling my airflow as I'm hitting it. It's going all at once. So I'm going to go ahead and put it up to 480. So I'm raising it up quite a bit. Yeah, 60 degrees. It just makes a huge difference to me. So, how about let's load... Oh, yesterday, I picked up some of this dirty girl. Pull and snap shatter. This shit's perfect for fucking these coils. I love smoking harder, more pliable shatter off these coils. It's just it's really easy to load. It seems to fucking burn really well. Fatty up in here. Decent sized chunk. Nothing insane though. You know, most I probably loaded on here is 0.3 just because I'm so picky about my flavor. I just don't want to burn off my terpenes. Before the oil is gone or I know I won't finish it. <clears throat> Alright. So we got the uh, quad coil, the new source quad coil, with the black ceramic and grade 1 titanium, and the source orb XL at 25 watts, going at 480 Fahrenheit. I almost shut my airflow all the way, what I have, so about half of a hole open, so that's one hole, I guess, you got one on each side. <clears throat> Let's see how it hits. I might need to adjust a little bit. Cheers. Very nice. Awesome fucking flavor. <clears throat> Very good. I fucking love this strain. Um, I fucking, I was so happy that they chose black ceramic over quartz to do this with or anything else. I prefer the black ceramic so much. Um, I feel like it just, it sustains that, your flavor for a couple more hits than the quartz, you know, because the quartz just drops down below it and you got a little, it's a little more porous than black ceramic is, so I like it a lot. Let's hit this one more time. Cheers. Alright guys, so that's it, <coughs> source <coughs> orb and the source nail with the new XXL quad coil, <coughs> I fucking approve of it, <coughs> I like it, I want to thank source for sending this stuff out, I really appreciate it, I want to <coughs> thank all of you for watching, <coughs> have a great night, thanks.